Hello everyone, let's take a look at this interesting geometry problem together. Given a trapezoid ABCD with side lengths of 1, 2, 3, and 4, we are asked to find the area of the trapezoid. If you'd like to try solving it yourself, please pause the video now. I will begin explaining the solution in 3 seconds. First, draw a parallel line to AC passing through point B and intersecting CD at point E. Then, draw a perpendicular line from point D to line BE, meeting at point F. Another perpendicular line is drawn from point B to line ED, intersecting at point G. In the parallelogram ABC, with AB equal to 1, C is also equal to AB, which is 1. GD is equal to CD minus CG, which equals 4 minus 1, resulting in 3, and BD is also 3. Therefore, triangle BDE is an isosceles triangle. According to the property of an isosceles triangle where the angle bisector, median, and altitude are concurrent, we find that DF is the median of BE, meaning BF equals FE and B equals AC, which is 2. Hence, BF equals FE, which equals 1. By applying the Pythagorean theorem in right triangle FED, we find that the length of FD is 2 times the square root of 2. Assuming the length of BG is H, the area of triangle BED is calculated as half of ED times H, which is also equal to half of BE times FD. Solving this equation, we find the value of H to be 3 quarters times the square root of 2. Finally, we can use the formula for the area of a trapezoid, half the sum of the bases multiplied by the height, which is half of AB plus CD times H, substituting the values. We find that the area of the trapezoid is 10 times the square root of 2 divided by 3. I hope this video has been enlightening for you. If you have a better solution, feel free to leave a comment in the section below. If you enjoyed this video, please remember to subscribe, like, and share. Your support is the driving force behind my continuous creation. Thank you, and see you in the next video.